More news now. Local researchers created this crash on purpose, and what they're learning could save lives. That high-tech crash lab is at the Medical College of Wisconsin. Researchers will use these test results with crash dummies to make child car seats safer. Ricky Mitchell reports. We are inside the Medical College of Wisconsin's crash lab where today they are testing the effects of a T-bone accident on a three-year-old child. The test itself happens fast, within a tenth of a second. But watch what happens in slow motion as the child test dummy is thrown around its European-style car seat. And the main things we look at are the head and the neck because that's the typical injuries that we see out in the field. Hans Hoshield is a senior research engineer with the Medical College of Wisconsin. He says this lab is equipped with 3D imaging and more than 30 cameras to track every direction the dummy moves. Some of this information that we're getting today will help uh, future either uh, manufacturers with building car seats or child car seats or building vehicle seats or uh, adding padding inside the seats uh, inside the vehicles if need be. According to Safe Kids, car crashes are the number one cause of unintentional death among children. But child safety seats can reduce fatal injuries by up to 71% for infants and 54% for toddlers. These researchers hope to learn how car seats can be made even safer. And that's kind of the idea behind it is that can we predict what type of injuries um, a child may experience in these types of environments. All of the data collected here today will eventually be published in scientific papers. Now, if you are concerned about how your child's car seat is connected, you can reach out to the Children's Hospital of Wisconsin who hold car seat clinics and they will walk you through all of the steps to make sure your child's safe. We have that information posted at TMJ4.com. Reporting from the Medical College of Wisconsin, Ricky Mitchell, today's TMJ4. And this could also potentially influence government regulations on vehicles and car seats in the future.